Hey guys, Game Boy Blue Sun 6 here, and today, I have a huge announcement on why I have took a large break from uploading videos on YouTube. So, if you are not aware, the main reason why I stopped uploading videos is because I'm more interested in schoolwork rather than making YouTube content. The reason for this is because I know that school is very important, and if I don't do schoolwork, my grades would be all Fs, which could result in major discipline. But don't worry, my grades are both A's and B's, so it's not the end of the world for me. Alright, so another reason why I have taken a large break from uploading videos on YouTube is because I spend time with my family sometimes. For example, I would watch movies with them, I would even play games with my family like Monopoly, Uno, Sorry, Game of Life, and more. Although, these things don't happen often, but I feel like that this is also way more important than uploading videos on YouTube. And not to mention that I would do chores with my family, like loading and unloading the dishwasher, doing laundry, taking out the trash, mowing the lawn, and pulling out weeds are my job. And yes, chores are very important, because it would be really helpful for my parents, and I could get even get awards for that too. Okay, and now with that out of the way, here is some important info to regarding my YouTube channel. I don't post content very frequently unlike what I did in late 2021 through mid-2022. The fact that I was given permission to make community posts back in October of 2022 is what made me not upload videos very frequently. Oh yeah, and not to mention that my profile picture on both YouTube and Discord is drastically different. The image shown here is a fan art of Super Ufio 64, which is a ROM hack of Super Mario 64, but Roblox themed. And some of you are wondering, why did you change your profile picture? Well, it is because of this YouTuber by the name of ABDULUPNEX. And for those of you who are unaware of who the heck this YouTuber really is, well, he is a TikTok content creator with over 3 million followers at the time of making this video. And his iconic line of all time is, You Gotta Go. And surprisingly, I used to be so obsessed with this channel, until one day, on March 4th, 2023, he uploaded a video called, If This Is Your Profile Picture, You Gotta Go. And you might be wondering, why are you very heated over this video? Well, the very first profile picture they mentioned was Roblox avatars, and I was literally extremely angry to the point where I slammed my phone as hard as I can against the wall. Although surprisingly, there does not appear to be any damage on my iPhone, mainly because my phone case is very durable. But I was watching this in the middle of my night, and the slam that was so hard that my stepdad had woke up, and he told me what was going on, and I told him that this YouTuber sucks. I hope his channel gets deleted soon, and my stepdad believes that I was yelling profanities at that YouTuber, which I really did. Because of this, my iconic profile picture that I've been using ever since the very beginning of my YouTube career was changed to an image that was representing Super Ufio 64, which is a ROM hack of Super Mario 64, but Roblox theme. Not only did my profile picture change, but my video banner and watermark also changed too. So I really wanted to make a video calling called Major Making Improvements to If This Is Your Profile Picture, You Gotta Go. The idea was just making major improvements so it could be very accurate too. If this is your profile picture, you gotta go. Like, for an example, I would replace Roblox avatars with something like NFTs, but during the making of that video, people like Roblox underscore HCKRSYT and Party Plays would force me to do the following. They would tell me to just ignore this YouTuber, it might be his opinion, and it could be a complete joke, or you don't have to be a mature man. And although I do believe that these guys do bring up a good point, 
my mind cannot accept it though, and it makes my mind feel so guilty because I really wanted to expose this TikTok clown so badly. But of course, I cannot do that because these two Roblox fanboys are ironically preventing me from being a bad Roblox YouTuber, which is very helpful, but at the same time, I feel like I'm being mistreated for some reason. Anyways, here's another reason why I have not uploaded videos for two for about two months. So I have this console named the Wii. And as it turns out, I have seemed to have a lot of energy to me playing on my Wii rather than making YouTube content. But the only problem about my Wii is that I don't own a capture card. But hopefully by Christmas of 2023, I can finally afford a capture card so I can finally start making new content for my YouTube from my Wii. Well, that's all I have to say about my entire reason on why I'm taking a big break from making YouTube content. Anyways, here are some upcoming content that I will plan to make once I am finally done with my sophomore year. For one, I am planning to make a sequel to my favorite video that I made of all time is Backstretch Battles Remaster Crash Compilation. The video has been in development from late January to mid-February of 2023, but I stopped development for no reason. But thankfully, all my progress has been saved to ca in CapCut. Another video that will be uploaded, which will happen right after my Factors Battle Master Crash compilation, is me exposing Artem Monster XD. This is the Roblox YouTuber that Pants23 wants me to expose. But since I have roasted the heck out of the best new Mighty a couple months ago, I'm not sure if I'm in the mood for that. But from what I've seen, Artem Monster XD does bad things on both YouTube and Discord, like, say, the N-Word. Hopefully when I'm done with my sophomore year, I will eventually try to expose Artem Monster XD. Yet another video that will be uploaded on my Wii if I can afford a capture card is Little Bow Wow Shenanigans and Mario Kart Wii CTGP Revolution. For those of you who don't know who Little Bow Wow really is, he has taken inspiration from Michael Maroots, known as Little Bow Wow. He is so funny, and I want him to be a main character for my YouTube channel, just not to be confused with Little Bow Wow, the rapper in real life. Well, that's all I have to say, folks. Here's some breaking news, by the way. I will be planning to bring back my original profile picture once I am done my sophomore year, and maybe my video watermark can be banner will be changed too. Unfortunately, this will be the only a video in April, as I have some more work to do in real life. But for now, thanks for watching. Bye!